Welcome to Gray on Math. We are asked to solve this problem. We have two circles that are tangent to each other, and these two circles are both tangent to two lines, and these two lines are intersecting at a point, and they have at a point and an angle, and the angle exterior it is 120 degrees. And we are to find the radius of the green circle. Okay, so first thing that we have to do is we need to draw a line from the center of this blue circle to this intersection of the tangent lines for the green and the blue circle. Okay. And next is we label this length as this since this is 5 then this should be 5 also this should be 5 and this should be r this is r so this line is actually 5 plus r okay and so next thing that we have to do is we need to draw a line from this point the center of the green circle and we draw a horizontal line towards the radius of this blue circle so this should be a line and since this is r if we project that line then this is also r so this length this remaining length should be 5 minus r since the total is r so 5 minus r okay okay so next is we focus on the angles so if this exterior angle is 120 degrees then this angle should be 60 degrees this to the total of this so that would be 60 degrees Okay, so next is we form actually two right triangles because we have two tangent lines for this circle. So this triangle is actually congruent with this triangle. So if they are congruent, then this 60 degrees should be bisected. So this should be one angle should have a measure of 30 degrees 30 and this angle should be also 30 degrees okay so since this red line is actually parallel to this the line at the bottom then this angle should be also 30 degrees okay so this angle is actually 30 degrees okay so next is we focus on this small triangle here this small triangle here and we notice that the sign of 30 of 30 degrees is simply equal to opposite which is 5 minus r divided by opposite over the hypotenuse then that is 5 plus r 5 plus r And next is, since we know that the value of sine of 30 is equal to 1 half, it is equal to 5 minus r all over 5 plus r. So if you simplify that, you have, by cross multiplying, you have 5 plus r r is equal to 2 times 
times 5 minus r. So if you simplify further, you have 5 plus r is equal to 10 minus 2r. So, okay, so next is if we simplify this, we have on the right hand side, we have 10 minus 5, and on the left, we have r plus 2r. If you put this negative 2r on the right, so that becomes 3r is equal to 10 if you, minus 5, negative 5, because if you put this 5 to the right hand side then you have 5 so therefore we have r is equal to 5 divided by 3 or 5 thirds centimeters and that is our answer so thank you for watching until the end of the video please like the video if you like our solution and don't forget to subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon so you will be updated for more math videos like this. Thank you. Bye.